more exciting every time we get nominated for an Emmy because um, I think, uh, I don't know, every time it's a surprise. You know, you don't ever assume anything. There's so many good shows out there right now. Um, but also, I think there's this feeling of, wow, we really want to maintain what we have and have had. And to continue getting recognized by the Academy, it, it means that we're sustaining the quality of the show, which is really exciting and it's a really nice feeling. How's having a part in um, Amber's death inadvertently, um, it certainly affects his relationship with Wilson, clearly, and, um, and I think it also affects the relationship with the new team because they obviously were close to her and were working side by side with her as they were going through that process of elimination and figuring out who was going to stay. I think the way that it would affect uh, Cameron and the way she relates to House would be because Cameron has lost someone close to her. She lost her husband and watched him go through a horrible illness and, and pass away. And um, even though it wasn't Cameron's fault that her husband passed away, I think she understands that feeling of guilt of, why well, am I the one who's alive and you're the one who's, and this person is the one who's gone. So I think there may be a little bit more of a, a bond there in terms of dealing with those feelings, those remnant feelings of guilt. Going into season five, it's um, evolved into something really nice. They really feel like colleagues now, I think. Um, they're more toe-to-toe, -to -toe, you know, whereas season one, two, and three was her under him and sort of growing as a doctor, and then season four was this departure of her sort of having her own thing, but there's still sort of this defensiveness in her sassiness of, like, I'm going to prove that I can stand on my own, and now in season five, she's more seasoned. Well, I guess in a way, the new team represents any new audience. You know, I, I think that, you know, when we were the old team, we sort of were the eyes and ears and senses sort of of the audience members because we were shocked by his crazy outlandish things that House would do. And um, we were outraged by his unethical behavior. And, um, and all of this was so new to an audience that that audience was sort of like living through that with us. And now that we've moved past that, we've moved into different parts of the hospital and you bring in the new team, they become the eyes and ears and senses of the new audience. I've actually really enjoyed interacting with the new team more and getting to know them better because I really barely worked with them last season and had very little sense of who they were. I mean, you know, I'd see them in passing and be like, hey, how are you, you know? And, but now I actually have a relationship with all of them and, and really enjoy working with all of them. So it's been nice to sort of see how the show has integrated everybody back in together so it's more really a sense of the nine of us.